Meow. Hi, it's Penny Bowden here, and we are going to do a, a yawning putty tat here. Just getting the general shapes in here. Feeling them out and getting them in. Let's get the nice swing of the ears and eyes. Sorry, it keeps moving. Didn't realize it was doing that to me, but it does stop. Just kind of want to get the ears in as one entity so they go together well. And, and same with the eyes, and that's why I do the eye line. I'm going to move that top of that mouth up a bit. A lot of correcting at this stage. This is my messy stage. So now I'm feeling out where, where I want to put those eyes in. Bit of a messy nose, but I think it gives it lots of character. There we go with the moving again. That mouth was a little bit too pointed at the bottom. So we'll fix it up. And that tongue, that delightful tongue. Tabby marks are so great for adding character and to, and for contour too, because we make sure they go around the contour of the head. The, the shape of the cat's head helps add to the roundness of the head. I'm going to put a bit of a head and shoulders in here. Looking a little stiff right now, but you'll see it come to life a little more as we go on. Just tiny little lines make a big difference. Tiny little lines in the right places. Yeah, too dark there. Help that tongue stand out and give it a bit of curve. And oh, delightful fangs, a hint of fangs. So we're faster now. We were at two times the speed and now we're at five times the speed. So we'll finish it up, get the finishing touches. Picking up some of the lines around the outside that adds character and movement, especially because they don't they don't go right on top of each other, and I find that that really helps get some movement in and some character, some variation to give the eye the viewer's eye some interest to look at. I love to hear from you, so drop me a comment. Tell me about yourself or your cat. Where you live in the world, I love to hear what country you're in. I love to connect with people from all over the world. And what you want to learn about drawing cats. And the whiskers, I find with this pose, you notice the whiskers are pointing right down and that just really adds to the movement of this yawn. I'm liking it. You wouldn't want to stick your finger in that mouth. Lots of sharp teeth. Thank you so much for watching today. There's lots more videos to come. And yes, tell me what you want to learn. See you next time.